Malaysia has a problem with floods. Thanks to factors like climate change, there's more these days, and it's a problem many countries face. Like Japan, one of the world's most disaster-prone nations and also one of the most prepared. I got to see why at an October exhibition on disasters in Kuala Lumpur, held by University of Technology Malaysia's Malaysia-Japan International Institute of Technology, or MJIIT, with lessons learned from Japan's tsunamis and earthquakes, as well as Malaysia's floods, and some of the best anti-disaster technologies by Japanese and Malaysian companies. From aerial and satellite surveys to AI tools, devices detecting earth movement or rock slides, floodgate systems and early warning systems. These innovations are linked to disaster risk reduction, which means preparing for a natural catastrophe so we can control the amount of damage when it happens. Floods can cost Malaysia millions if not billions of ringgit every year and untold human suffering. If we can reduce the effects from disasters, why not? The event co-hosted by the Embassy of Japan in Malaysia also saw a number of Japanese and Malaysian businesses discussing deals and partnerships on the matter. Disaster risk reduction is also in line with the UN's SDG 11, Sustainable Cities and Communities. Preparing isn't exciting or flashy, and while we can't completely prevent disasters, we can go a long way when protecting people in a crisis. If you want to know more about disaster risk reduction in Malaysia, check out MJIIT on social media or on their website. Info is in the text.